Right, this is a final video of this game. We've got as far as turn four, and this is how the table looks. So obviously the Panzer tanks move through the edge and across here. Leroy's idea was to start firing at my Canadians over here, but they've slipped through this uh, alleyway just through here. So I'll try and show you them. They're just round there. That's what's left of that Waffen SS squad that was along here. So easy only one standing now. The Schwimm wagon he fired on the Canadian squad that was coming around here. I had a few men here, but Leroy brought his Schwimm wagon round and shot four men. He managed to kill four men. So that's what the town's looking like. So it's a bit of a draw there, I would say. Now. Leroy's strong point, he's still got his medium mortar, he's still got his 105mm howitzer, he's still got his medium machine gun, and they're the Waffen SS, he's still got a medium machine gun for his German grenadiers. Now the two platoons of Waffen SS have been destroyed now, so there's not much action here now. The Canadian squad of mine is still hiding in the orchard. My idea was to try and get up here somewhere and try and rush Russia's strong point on the hill. Now this squad of German grenadiers of Leroy's, they've managed to wipe out the Americans coming across this field here. The Tiger tank, he's moved his Tiger tank up to the crossroads and he is fired at the American infantry there, but he missed. So his Tiger tank is pretty useless, so he needs a better crew. Now, if you can see, like there's this squad here of German grenadiers, they're still pretty much intact, but we have a squad, full squad of American infantry and a part squad there of American infantry. Like I said before, we're not doing morale checks, so it's a fight to the death. I brought the Jeep down here and used that to fire at the last remains of Leroy's German Grenadier squad there. But before that happened, Leroy just had one man left with a Panzerfaust and the guy shot the Panzerfaust at the tank, the Sherman tank, and managed to destroy it. So that's out of the picture. Just move around the table, have a look at my side. Now I've still got a, an American medium mortar there, and I've been using that to pound Leroy's German Grenadiers across there. Leroy's still got his uh, remains of that squad there, German Grenadiers. I still have a medium mortar, and the trucks ended up there, the American truck with a machine gun on it. The priest's still alive, but he's hiding in cover. He's managed to take out a, a few of the German Waffen SS. The squad that was here has moved over there, so there's only two of them remaining now. And like you can see, that's what's left of the Canadian squad that was there so that's that so yeah well, i've decided to wrap up the game because i need the table i need to start getting on with some more terrain and as you can see the the house colors changed i did go on google earth to have a look at the houses in france around normandy area and they are like a, a more of a brownie color creamy sandstone and orange clay tiles on the roofs mostly so i think that looks more more like france now i've still got the street lights and the signs and all the little details to put in yet and the gardens of course as well so i want to get on with all that you see i'm afraid i'm gonna to have to wrap the game up and uh, call it a draw we decided to call it a draw so that leroy didn't get too upset about losing so yeah so that was a good game but uh, now it's on with more terrain and the bridge crossing. So I'm going to get that finished. I'm going to also start making the, the shelves to put the terrain in when I finish the terrain. So yeah, that's what's coming next.